What's up guys, it's Legend X Ronin, and we finally know who the first character who will be released in the Combat Pack 2, and that character is Tribor, yes. Netherrealm Studios tweeted out this tweet yesterday saying, This Sunday, get ready for a very special comeback cast, live from ESL Studios in Burbank. And in the tweet, we see that the comeback cast is titled The Cyber Initiative, which we all know is referring to Tribor. So this Sunday at 3.45 Pacific time, we will get to see Triborg in action during the comeback cast. And for those of you who don't know what the comeback cast is, it's basically like a stream that the people at NetherRealm Studios have where they will normally showcase like new characters or new things for the game. So we're going to get to see like a breakdown for all the Triborg's variations and like all the moves that they have, along with possibly a fatality or two and some possible brutalities. Now I can't wait to finally see all the things that Triborg has in store for all of us when we finally get to play as him and get to see what all his variations can do. And as you guys already know, I'm looking forward to seeing Cyber Smoke the most. He's my favorite cyborg and he's finally made a return in Mortal Kombat and I just can't wait to see what all that he can do. And let me be the first to say that I guarantee that Triborg's variations will be his unit numbers. Like, that would be so cool to actually see instead of having something like Sector or Cyrax variation in my opinion. Also, one of my friends bought up something that I thought was pretty cool and that is, he said that what if Triborg has like the MK3 Cyborg winning pose as his pose when he does brutalities and I gotta say, that would be so awesome to see in the game. So I hope that this is something they actually did with Triborg and all of his variations. So with Triborg being the first character in the Combat Pack 2, I think it's safe to assume that my second theory on the possible order for the Combat Pack 2 characters is true. If you look at the picture that we got in the Combat Pack 2 gameplay video showing off the characters, you see that the order in this picture is Triborg, Leatherface, Alien, and then Baraicho. I think it's safe to assume that this is more than likely the order that the characters will be released. Now I gotta say, it doesn't really surprise me that this will be the order because in the video, Tribal was the only character who had all three of their variations shown off, so he is obviously the only character who is like complete. And I also think that the possible reason to why Raicho is probably the last character is because they're probably thinking that he might sell the lease, which I kinda understand why they would think that due to the how some people think about Bright Show, but I guess like that will probably be like the best choice for them to do. So if this is the order, I think that I'm all right with it. I mean, personally, I would much rather have Triborg and Bright Show first because I'm looking more forward to playing as them two. But at least I get to play as Triborg until I get Bright Show in the combat pack. So I think I'll be pretty all right with that. But I guess we won't entirely know if this is true until next week's comeback cast. Now, if this comeback cast is like the others, then that would mean that we could possibly have Tribor playable next Tuesday. As some of you may know, whenever they show off a new DLC character in the comeback cast, that character is always available the following Tuesday, so we could possibly be able to play as Tribor next week. Also, if Tribor will be available next week, then that would mean that the comeback pack 2 will finally be available for purchase and we will finally find out everything that's in it such as like the possible themed skin packs that will come with each character. Now we did learn in the gameplay video the skins that will come when you first get the combat pack 2 but we still don't know yet if we will be getting like more skins like the themed skin packs with each character in the combat pack 2 like how we did with the combat pack 1. Not to mention we may find out when we will finally be getting the pit stage as a new stage in the combat pack 2. So what do you guys think about next week's comeback cast and what are y'all possibly looking forward to seeing from Tribor during the stream? Let me know all y'all's thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like. Let's see if we can get this video at least 50 likes. Also, if you haven't heard about the new netcode that they're working on for Mortal Kombat X, they're currently working on making the game much better and lag free experience online with the new enhanced netcode. And currently they're accepting signups for the beta to test it out. So if you would like to do that, you can sign up for that. I'll leave a link for it in the descriptions below. Just remember that not everyone will be able to do it. So be sure to sign up as quick as you can. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at LegendXDrone and keep up with all things that I do with my channel. And if you're new to my channel, please be sure to hit that subscribe button for all things Mortal Kombat. This is Ronan, and I will see you guys later. 
And then we also get to see Alien's grab move where he bites the back of the opponent's neck and launches his tail through the opponent's head. Right after that we see Alien using like the enhanced version of Baraka's signature Chop Chop Blades, but right after this you see him.